Geocentricity The Orrery How this simple mechanical system shows that you cannot tell the difference between the heliocentric and geocentric models. You cannot falsify geocentricity simply by observing the sun, planets and moons. In this stylized animation of the heliocentric model, we see the inner planets, represented by one green circle, the Earth in blue, and the outer planets, one brown circle, all rotating slowly round the Sun, the Earth completing one circuit every year. The inner planets circle the Sun much quicker than the outer planets. The stars are effectively stationary. This moving system can be made into a mechanical system using the Sun at the centre and the planets on long arms that slowly go round the Sun, each having their moons circling the planet on short arms. In the model, they are all moving anti-clockwise around the Sun, and of course, the Earth is also spinning rapidly on its axis in an anti-clockwise direction as seen from the North Pole, to represent it turning round once per day as it circles the Sun in one year. Now imagine that while the mechanism is still operating, you take hold of the Earth firmly in your hand and lift the whole mechanism off the base stand. The machine will continue to operate normally, but now that you are holding the Earth stationary, the rest of the planets and the Sun and stars are now spinning round the Earth in a clockwise direction once every 24 hours. What is immediately obvious is that because the mechanism is still operating and controlling the planets, the relationship of distance and rotation etc. between all the planets and the Sun are exactly the same as they were when still on the base stand and circling the Sun. What is happening is at the end of every 24 hours the planets are in almost the same position in the orrery, but not quite. They have moved very slightly according to their slow rotation around the Sun during the year. We can see this in the following simple animation. Here we have the heliocentric yearly rotation of the planets again. But with the same model, we have the whole system rotating around the Earth every 24 hours. At the end of each day, the planets have moved slightly on their much slower passage around the Sun. On the following day, they have moved a little further, and so on each day. So let us restate the situation. The orrery creates the relative movements between the Earth, planets, stars and Sun. But if the Earth is held stationary, the whole mechanism rotates around the Earth every 24 hours but the relationships between the planets and Earth remains exactly the same. Therefore, by observations of the planetary system, you cannot tell whether we are in a heliocentric system or a geocentric system. So the retrograde motion of Mars or the motions of any other planets are exactly the same in both systems. The proof that we are in a geocentric system is found in the experiments of Michelson-Morley, Michelson-Gale, Sagnac's experiment and Aries' failure, all of which we have covered in other videos. I hope you found that interesting. Thank you for listening.